What is up, YouTube? I'm back with another banger, man. And today I'm going to do something a little different. As you can see, I'm playing the game. So this is uh, college football 25. If y'all haven't heard about it, it's the first time this game has came out in 10 years. So I had to, you know, do a little voiceover story time for y'all. So the story time I got today. Oh, yeah. Hold on. Before I even get started, I am Ohio State and I'm playing against my homeboy. So watch me get busy real quick. Y'all know I cannot lose in Madden, college football, none of that. So if y'all want to test that, comment down below if y'all want to play the game with me. But look, the story time is on how me and Richie got stuck in Atlanta, Baltimore, whatever you want to call it. So it, for those of you that don't know, me and Richie, we just went to Atlanta. We went to, down to Atlanta to get our chains and actually stay tuned and stay um looking at my page because i will be posting vlogs probably the next couple days so on the last night which was friday uh we went out and stuff we spent the last night basically the whole night basically just looking for a charging station we uh, went downtown a little bit before that and we did like kind of like you know we went to uh, a bar and stuff but then after that we had to charge the t Tesla. We got some more liquor, I think. Maybe. I don't know if we got more liquor or not, but we had to charge the Tesla before we went to the next move. And we couldn't find no charging stations that had the right uh, adapter because we had a 2023 Tesla. So that kind of like threw a damper in the trip a little bit, but everything was going perfect until then, literally. So like, you know, it wasn't too bad. So we finally, like we, I ain't even gonna lie. We probably went to like I would say like 10 different charging stations. I'm not even going to lie. And then we finally found one that uh, we had used earlier in the day. We should have just went to that one in the first place. So fast forward to the next day. So we wake up the next day late because I only set my alarm. Richie didn't set his alarm. And we both must have not just heard my alarm go off. So we woke up late and we rushing around. We probably get out of the room by like 9 30 10 ish no probably about like 9 30 ish 9 40 and but like i said like it's a tesla so we gotta go charge it so like so we rush in and everything we get up out of the hotel and first off the tesla was supposed to be back at 10 o'clock and it's like 10 right now or we just not going to charge it then we gotta drive 30 minutes to the airport so we go charge it and when we there charging i'm like bro I left my wallet at the hotel, bro. Oh, my God. Richie was hot. I ain't going to lie. Richie was pissed. But so I hurry up, call the hotel, and they put my wallet to the side. But the whole thing about these Teslas is, like I said, they take 30 minutes to charge. So now it's like 1030. Now it's 1020, 1030, somewhere in that time frame. So we hurry back to the hotel. I get my wallet. And then we got to go take the Tesla back. So we get to the airport at about, well, um, where we had to drop off the air. I mean, where we had to drop off the Tesla, it was kind of by the airport. So that was about 20, 30 minutes away. So we pull up there about 11 o'clock. But keep this in mind, chat. Our plane don't take off until 12.06. So it's 11 o'clock. All right. We got time, Loki. We Loki got time. So and, and then like boarding starts at like 1120, I think something like that. 1120. So we get on the little shuttle thing and we head into the airport. It's like 1120. And crazy part is the dude on, on the shuttle is he said he don't know because he heard funny stuff about uh, Frontier Airlines. So we get to the desk. They talk about because we didn't check in um, since we didn't check in an hour before the flight took off online that we can't get on the plane, even though we there on time. So we got there at about like 1120, but they talking about we can't, we can't uh, get to the back. So y'all know how hot I am, I'm, I'm, but all right, all right, cool. So see if you can give me a little discount on, on the uh, next flight out of here. No, they talking about the next flight out of here, $400 to get to Detroit. I'm like, bro, come on. Everything got lay layovers. So basically, that was our best flight for the day. And I ain't even going to lie. I knew that when I was booking flights. So I don't even know why I was playing around. But so, boom, we find a little $250 flight with Southwest. And our bags and everything was free. So cool. We get on the flight with Southwest. And 
everything was cool, but until we landed in Baltimore, so we had a, a like it was supposed to be like a couple hour delay in Baltimore. Man, we sitting in Baltimore for about an hour, bro. I get a text on my phone. It's like it, it's Saturday night now. They talking about we're delayed until 5 p.m. the next day, which is Sunday, bro. So I'm like, bro, hell no, nah, bro. I got to get to work. I got to get home. They we at the airport, like asking them what can they do for us. They basically saying they can't do nothing for us, but give us an earlier flight on Saturday. <coughs> I mean, on Sunday. So it's about like 10 o'clock, 10, 15 a.m. So we we have to buy another hotel, which is Oh, I, I ain't gonna lie. I don't know if the hotel wasn't too bad, like another hundred or two hundred. Then we had an Uber there because we didn't have a rental, and it's late at night. We didn't get there until late. We Uber there. The Ubers is a hundred dollars there and back. And then so we get to the we get to the airport the next day. Everything cool. Everything cool. I ain't gonna lie. It's a nice flight. You know, open seating. You know, we didn't send it back. Okay, cool, man. Tell me why we touched down in Detroit. Touchdown in Detroit. Everything's still cool. We waiting for our luggages. Rich luggage come down. Everything cool. And I'm like, bro, where is my luggage, bro? And I'm talking to the people. Don't know where my luggage is. And I ain't going to lie. Y'all going to have to like, comment, and subscribe for the next part. I ain't going to lie. They did me dirty. They did your boy luggage dirty. So like, comment, share, subscribe for part two. And y'all see... Right here, this is just a different gameplay. You know, I needed uh, some extra footage while I was talking. So this is like an old Miss game. I'm pretty sure I'm old Miss. Yeah, I'm old Miss. So y'all see me out here dotting them up. But yeah, everybody like, comment, subscribe if you want to hear part two, what happened to my luggage. But yeah, I ain't going to lie. We had to spend a whole extra day in Baltimore. It was terrible, bro. We had to eat gas station food. It's, it's a zero out of ten. I would not, I would not recommend at all. But Southwest or Frontier, honestly, me personally, I would not fly with them.